make sure our server is running it's running we need uh, our access token for that we have to fire our client application to get access token to test this api let's copy this url in postman paste this and uh, it's payment slash pay request is uh, post request and uh, we will send json data in this application and we will set headers accepts json so it needs token and address array let's try to make require this with the setup we are getting method not found exception because we have to add api here perfect let's set up this uh, address object for address object uh, we should send these informations and i'm not going to share my real number so i will just uh, type random number here let's uh, fire our old application that we developed in our previous tutorial this i think this was our application uh, let's uh, open bash window here and type npm start open your console because we will get access token here submit this is our access token and we can use this access token in postman uh, to make payment and hopefully this will return unable to pay why is that yep we have to fix this first okay um i don't know what's happening here so to debug this uh, let's uh, go to our application and in error message i will command this out and let's send actual error message that we are getting from this response so that we can see what's going on save it and uh, send this request again curl call failed okay why is that quick google search told me that uh, we are getting this error because uh, we are testing this on uh, local machine 
and uh, you will not get this error in your production environment okay um, to fix this uh, we can you know uh, turn this uh, SSL verification uh, for our development environment uh, so if we are using sandbox environment I want to disable SSL verification and let's uh, try again let's uh, try to get a fresh token clear this out submit again let's uh, try it again and we are able to make our payment let's verify it in sales Uh, you can see that uh, we made this payment on this date and uh, we made a payment of $10. Let's uh, change this payment to $25. Save it. And uh, get our access token again for this payment and send your request paid successfully check this out and payment is made uh, so this was the server side part uh, our server is ready. We have this uh, API to call to make payment uh, from client side. In the next video tutorial, I will show you how to integrate this application to your server side so that uh, you can just uh, type your information and then click submit or pay to make your payment. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you so much for watching.